the huge Art Deco statue at uh, Rio de Janeiro of Jesus Christ with his outstretched arms welcoming us to the 2016 Olympic Games. How many of you saw that on the news when we were looking at the Olympics? Oh, your memory's gone. That was only two years ago. After seeing that Brazilian icon over and over in the news segments, I put Christ, the Redeemer statue, on my bucket list. But now, after photographic and info research at DailyMail.com, the Christ statue is off my bucket B list. Even with the train to the top of the Cor Covado mountain, then the elevator. Because this religious statue, there are crowds many times greater than for our Statue of Liberty on Ellis Island in New York. Some of the other most famous locations I've experienced are walking sideways up the Great Wall of China. That's really interesting with the ginkgo trees. There are no porta potties, and um, the ginkgo trees go there in October, and then you can see the foliage changing in uh, the ginkgo trees, touching huge columns. My husband says, isn't it time to leave the Colosseum? And he said, how, many, how much time do you want to be here? He said, we've been here for six hours already. I said, no, I haven't done everything I wanted to do. I even saw a high altitude um, a crow. And I got a photo. Uh, with a Matterhorn in the background, and this man was holding his little doggy. I said, what are you doing? And he says, because I want a picture of the doggy magazine of me and the Matterhorn and the dog. Go, okay. Dancing in the snow on Mount Fuji, I already told you about that. Plus laughing in Echo Amphitheater in New Mexico across from Ghost Ranch, where Jojo O'Keefe was for 30 years. Maybe I can't handle the 1,063 foot height of the, what am I talking about in France? The Eiffel Tower. How many of you have been to the Eiffel Tower? Did you go up? Oh yeah, oh yeah, she said, okay. Uh, so a virtual tour would be great. Actually, I get dizzy and I want to jump off and fly and when I get up at heights. Uh, after I visit Monet's Gardens in France, I'll pay my respects to my relative, um, relative's graves in France. Grave in France. Then to England to walk around Stonehenge with my brother's memory. Thanks, Rick Steves, for your European travel shows that take us to so many wonderful places without having to pack. I don't know about you. How many of you get, have high anxiety for packing? I do. I mean, it's tragic. I'm just so bad of a packer. Fly, pay, and fight crowds of tourists. P.S. See the movie Bucket List. And this is a Tonka, five lines instead of three. Brazilian icon survives lightning strikes. Christ welcomes the world with steel rods to ground him in love and peace. Thank you.